Let's talk about a million. If we write it out, here's how it looks. Pretty big number. But how big is it really? It's such a big number, it is hard to actually really comprehend. So we're going to do a couple different things to see if we can't figure out how big a million is and at least uh, kind of understand it. How about how long would it take to count to a million? How many days? What if we counted at the rate of one number per second? So one, two, three, and so on. Every second we're counting. How long would it take us to get to a million? Would it take us a few hours? Would it take us days? Would it take us weeks? Months? Years? Well, let's figure it out. All right. If we counted every second, well, there are 60 seconds in one minute. And there are 3,600 seconds in an hour. And there are, well, 24 hours in a day, so that would give us 86,400 seconds in one day. So, how many days would it take to count to a million? Well, let's divide one million by, let's give us some commas there, 86,400. Well, it would take us about 12 days. That's a long time, isn't it? To count to a million. Well, it's a big, one million is a big number. Let's do a little something else that I think might be fun. All right, let's try a little experiment. This is a quarter teaspoon. Um, we are going to see how much water, how many drops, and a quarter teaspoon will, it's slightly more than one milliliter. So we're going to find out how many drops are in the water are in one milliliter. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. And we're going to stop there because that's because um, there are about twenty drops in a milliliter. All right, so we determined there are about 20 drops in one milliliter. So let's multiply that by a thousand. And that will give us the number of drops in a liter since there are 1,000 milliliters in one liter. So 20 times 1,000, let's get our two, let's count all of our zeros. 20 times 1,000 gives us 20,000 drops in one liter. Well, let's find out how many liters are in a million? Or 
really a million drops, how many liters a million drops is. So we are going to divide one million Divide that by twenty thousand, because that's how many drops there are in a liter, and that's going to give us about fifty liters. So 50 liters of water is equal to 1 million drops. Wow, that is a big number. All right, it is time to now watch the video for your learning tasks on page 8.